For the second year in a row, Topeka police say overall crime is down. And the police chief says one way to keep the trend going is to keep guns out of the hands of criminals. KSNT News reporter Alec Gardner explains how they're getting you involved in doing that. The Topeka Police Department seized 462 guns in 2018. That's up 31 from the previous year. The city also saw 13 fewer homicides than 2017. Police Chief Bill Cochran says he believes the efforts of his police department are paying off. Cochran says with the rise of concealed carry, officers are encountering more guns. The numbers of individuals that are committing crimes that carry in firearms uh, seems to be going up. But he says it's not just about taking guns away from criminals. It's about fighting crime from all angles. Focus on violent crime. We also educate the public and we also uh, get the community involved in, in our efforts. And so it's a holistic approach. And people are noticing the differences in the department. If you can show the community that the opinion is being acted upon and being addressed, I think that that is extremely critical to the relationship that the police department has with its community. Here lately you've been seeing a lot more uniformed officers, especially around central Topeka. I mean, I think they've been on top of it a lot more. Cochran says the safer the city is, the more attractive it will be to live in. We got some really great things going on in the city of Topeka, and so um, when people feel good about the city, then th good things are going to happen, and the police department is going to be a very important part of that. Chief Cochran stressed for people not to leave guns in unlocked cars because it gives criminals an opportunity to have a gun when police are trying to keep one out of their hands. In downtown Topeka, Alec Gartner, KSNT News. And one way the department is taking guns off the streets is through their Gun Stoppers program. It offers up to $500 in exchange for tips about illegal guns. 